Hello everyone, my name is Onetrub7, this is my Dodger Kebab, and today we're looking at the YouTube app for the PlayStation 3, which has just come out, and it's good and exciting. Let's get it over and done with, first of all, yes, it is good, okay, it is good. Um, you've just seen there my, that my iPhone has just connected, um, I'll explain how to configure those sort of bits after the video, how to do all the installs and that, after the main review part here, which is about three and a half minutes long. Um, but I'm just going to quickly talk about now about the actual app itself. Um, it is good, uh, it, although it's not shown quite in this video very well. It is. It does load pretty quickly. Um, everything's set out fairly logically. You scroll up and down for different things like your uploads, um, like your your subscriptions, uh, recommended content. Um, you know your stuff and then eventually like the settings and things here you can just see me scrolling through my uploads there um, you want to know is it HD yes yes it will play HD content Hello, it will play it in HD just Dodge in case Kebab. you wanted to know Today so I think we've got that oh there's me you can hear me talking starting a human character up here have their period and it's different in both versions Jumping a bit there, just jumping through the video, uh, scrolling quite quick. Um, so yes, it does play in HD. It is good. So straight away an improvement over what the uh, browser does. And it's all a lot faster, obviously, because it's a proper app. Um, so what what more to say about this? Um, only gripe really so far is when you're typing stuff using like the search, it has the same sort of thing as the Xbox does where you scroll left and right through the letters rather than bringing up the PlayStation um, keyboard, like the on-screen keyboard. That is really because this is just a port of the um, PlayStation app that smart TVs can have. So it's the same sort of thing. But we're going to look at a couple of other videos there. Not that one, that wasn't a very good choice because that's just someone filming a TV. So we get past that. But um, yeah, you can you can see here there's some uh, bit of football there. That was clearly football. But yeah, so I think I've covered the most important things really. Is it good? Yes. Is it HD? Yes. Um, searching is a little bit naff. But there's other things you can do with it. Um, that are uh, pairing it to a particular device to use so the other device to control stuff. App for a change. I often get app like a iPhone or a tablet, that sort of thing. I'm using my iPhone, but I'll show that very soon. This is only available at the moment on the US store. I'm sure that will change very soon, but as I'm doing this video, it's only available on the uh, US store. So if you're not in America, which I'm not, obviously. Um, it, you can still get it, obviously, because I've made this video and recorded it and stuff. And I'll show you how to do that very shortly. I'm just going to, for the last little bit of footage here. I accidentally skipped when I shouldn't have done when I was recording this. And I couldn't be able to re-record it because I want to get this video out pretty quick. Get it out day one. But there's a Fireweavers channel there. It's Let's Cooperate. But anyway, yeah, so there's me, own Triple Seven. I have three um, accounts which I use an American and Japanese, and my default English one. Um, to find the YouTube app on the US store, I'm going to quickly just run through it here. So go into the store. Once you're in the store, scroll all the way to the bottom, and at the bottom, you'll find the um, media and apps section you go to the second icon in which is the PS3 apps no, nope, gone past it there up again, there we are, apps for PS3, there it is, go into there there and you'll see it on this page near the bottom there it is, YouTube it's only a small download it's only 22 meg I think something like that so it's quite small quite compact and uh, yeah once you've actually got it installed where where it puts it is in the movies and uh, sorry the yeah the TV and video services which is quite logical that's good right now let's talk about installing devices 
Okay, one of the first things you want to do is sign in with your YouTube account. Pretty easy. It gives you a code. You go to the website it tells you to go to. You put the code in, and then you allow it, and it automatically does it itself. You don't have to press any other button once you press allow access. Right, you've also got pairing a device, like an iPhone or a tablet. You click on the pair device uh, thing, and then it will say go to this website on your tablet. So you go to that website on your tablet slash phone. There it is. That's what you go into and then it gives you the instructions so you have to go to YouTube in the browser on your phone find that icon once you click that you'll find the Addy icon click that once you click that it gives you a code on well it gives you a code on the screen not long after that you put the code from the screen into your phone give it a name I call mine PS3 and then all of a sudden it's connected, it's done, and that's the video over. Well done, enjoy uh, PlayStation 3. Bye.